Hello, welcome to this Microsoft Word tutorial on creating a dynamic form like this. So I'm going to show you how to create something like this from scratch where you know you ask for someone's name and whatever name they type in here shows up in all the other places you need to show. So if I write I am Barack Obama, you see it shows up everywhere. If I write that I'm Donald Trump. Donald Trump it shows up in all the places that I so this can be very useful for creating uh, documents that are legal or official and you want people to sign up to something and then when they put their names put their name it shows up in all the places you need it I need you to be able to pick your gender I need you to be able to browse to your to your picture wherever it is and then and, and pick it Maybe this is mine and it shows up right there and you can adjust if you if you want. And if I want I can I can position it in the way I want it to to be. You can give it a little more uh, flexibility how it looks. I you can choose your educational qualification, you can pick your date of birth. So all of these, how do we do that? do them? So I'm going to start from scratch by taking off all what I've done. Going to take this off. I'm going to delete this also. I'm going to delete this. Delete this. Okay. So, number one, you need to enable developer tab. You need to have a developer tab as I have here. So, if you don't have yours enabled, which is the default in Microsoft Word, it's not enabled. You go to File, you go to Options, you go to Customize Ribbon you pick you look on the right side anyway you will most likely see your developer tab unchecked you check it to make sure it is checked and voila you will have developer tab and then we can start so for name uh all the controls we need are here on that controls they are, they are, they are, they are this stuff right here right here okay so I start with the rich text. It's used for things you need people to fill in text in. So I want you to fill in your name. Put that here. I want you to put your passport photograph so that I use the picture content control. I want you to put your gender. I use the checkbox and I specify maybe female. I specify male. I want you to put your qualification for that i use the combo box i want you to be able to right now you can't pick anything it's empty so i want to populate it with some options i go to properties i can come here and modify this to uh, pick pick one and then i start adding the options phd masters bachelor or you've got some you've got high school certificate hope that is well spelled certificate and maybe I'm okay with this as per the date of birth I put a date picker and then how do I make all these you know get tied together okay so the magic is in first of all for your name I pick this I pick the handle I write I pick the handle and copy I paste yeah but not ordinary paste I go to home paste paste special paste link so this is the super important aspect of it making sure you do paste link and then I'm going to do formatted text so paste link formatted text I do okay I do likewise for everywhere I need your name that you've typed there to show paste link formatted text and okay right now I can test it 
if you put in your name here you see it shows up here right so like I demonstrated before you can choose your highest degree you can pick your date of birth you can pick your passport or any image from your PC even online so I'm going to look for uh, let's use this this time around uh, and if I showed you you can arrange it you can even uh, resize it uh, so for now that's it thank you